this video is for a comment I got in that first video I dropped on how to set up auto tune and really I'm just gonna try to simplify it because I have a lot of different artists come through here that like auto tune and auto tune was really started off as a as a pitch corrector to tune and not have the artificial sound like the robotic sound so i'm gonna show you a setup that i have pretty much oh i think i use the real time one advanced one yeah i think that's the one i see everybody use and right now it's on my voice and it's in chromatic c and soprano i'm a male so i'm gonna put it on low male and the first thing you want to really do is find the key of the song. So you might want to invest in this one, which is auto key. I think it's like $49. You play the music with that plug in on it and it'll find the key for you. What we're going to use is F minor. Even though I sent it over here, oh, it actually works with my UAD. That, that's pretty good. Didn't know. Didn't know that it works. So I sent it. Uh, let me go back to there. It says send to auto tune. And I sent it and it came right over here. But if, it, if you don't have the same auto tune that works with auto key, just put it in here put it there f and f and a minor scale okay now that it they kind of put it in there i usually start off see how retune speed is i put it at zero this is at zero humanize i usually put it at around 50 okay after you get the key in there which is f minor by using the auto key what I usually do is kind of turn, turn on the track and kind of sing along with it until I find like a little, a little melody. So I'm finna try that now. And that's what you're gonna have to do with the artist too. Tell them to go ahead and try it. Yeah. Yeah, I usually go up to about one. Yeah. Okay, now I saw that it was a note in there when I sounded off. That's why I go to this advance right here. I'm going to show you. That that C looked like it wasn't working in there. This this is the whole catch what everybody is missing. Even though it's within the key and it'll work if you play the chorus and the melody in a certain way. But when you only trying to sing on a, a few notes, like what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go through here. I know that F, A flat, and c is a chord and so, so you could do it this way by taking out just the other notes that you think you're not going to use in that uh in that chord you know f a flat and c works i could take out e flat too but i think it works because that's a seventh of the chord so really since if you don't know any theory you could go through here and kind of start taking out notes not bypass but remove the note remove it completely so it won't sing on that note if you just wanted one note pretty much this to me i call this the taylor swift 
you're setting up a Taylor Swift because I, I listen to her songs and I say, man, she only singing three notes. You can pretty much go through her whole song playing three notes and learn her melodies. So that's the same thing with this auto tunes, what people are missing that's going on. But if you're good at it, you could just focus on those three notes and sing it. But if you're not that great of a singer, just take out the notes that you think is a problem. So I'm going to turn it back on and I'm going to sing, sing again. Yeah. Well, leave me. See, it's still that C. I see that C. That C is becoming a problem. So I took that C out. And it sounds a lot better. So no matter if I put this C back in, you will see that it's going to mess it up. So watch, I'll put that C in and then mess it up. Making the problems So that's That's the main part That everybody Is missing that, That's like the cheat code That a lot of engineers And people are not giving you So that's why It's hidden like this You see how it's hidden Where it don't really Give you the option to take those notes out but that's why in advanced mode right here but the older version it was already in there where you can remove it right here in the middle that's the cheat code thank y'all for watching